Then what we usually do is we came up with a drill series for Al, for Alex with the T low so that his back knee has to drive down and through. So he basically gets closer to contact as opposed to away from it. Perfect. Okay, one thing I, I want to point out is how every ball has been on the net. You really don't want anything up there. Right. It's this angle. Everything's there. Not pounding the ball into the ground, but working like that. And in order to do that, the key is going to be getting his backside and his hands and everything connected to contact, and that'll allow him to be flat. If you just go real slow to contact for a minute, mm -hmm. Alex, I'll show you. With your backside, your hands. As soon as he does that, he's basically put his bat in the zone, in the zone, in the zone, in the zone, and then out of the zone by having this rotate and get there. This rotation of his lower half is going to allow his hands to work in line and linear. All right. Perfect. One more. Okay, that's a short bat, and then we'll go to the regular bat. We start low. Basically, the larger bat here is going to give him a bigger lever, so you're going to, the bell is going to have a different sound. It's going to be more explosive, louder but the swing doesn't change. And if we did this from a side view, what we'd see is Alex's head staying right in line the whole time. 